Change of Stance by Henry Kissinger on Ukraine, Bombs at Davos, Switzerland. What did he suggest about Putin's Russia? Former U.S. Secretary of State Henry Kissinger told the World Economic Forum in Davos via video link that Russia should be given a, ch a chance to rejoin the international system after any peace deal in Ukraine and in Russia, while he changed his opinion in relation to Ukraine, saying that now the only way is to join NATO and it can no longer be neutral. He said that to avoid an escalation of a nuclear conflict, the West must continue to engage in discussions with Russia and not let it feel that there is a war against the Russian state itself. Kissinger, who served under President Nixon's and Ford, also said that U.S. military support for Ukraine should continue until a ceasefire line is reached or accepted in preliminary talks. He said, I believe the dialogue in dialogue with Russia as long as the war continues and in an ongoing process of discussing discussion between Europe, America, and Russia, while the conditions of sanctions and other pressures will be maintained until a final settlement is reached, I think this is a way to prevent the escalation of war, he said. He said the idea of a neutral Ukraine under these circumstances no longer makes sense. Kissinger is 99 years old, and that's this is what he said at the World Economic Forum's annual meeting in Davos, Switzerland, taking place now. The former U.S. Secretary of State urged Ukraine's NATO membership would be appropriate once peace is secured. He said, before this war, I was against Ukraine joining NATO because I was afraid that the process we are seeing now would sta start. Now that the process had reached its level, the idea of a neutral Ukraine under these conditions no longer makes sense. And at the end of the process, I described there should be guarantees from NATO in whatever forms the Western alliance can develop in the country. But I believe that Ukraine's accession to NATO would be the appropriate result, he emphasized. Ukrainian neutrality was a key demand of Russia during the negotiations held last March. The 15-point draft included Kiev giving up its ambitions to join NATO and agreed not to host foreign military bases or weapons in exchange for protection from allies such as the US, UK, and Turkey. That the proposal that Ukraine now join NATO came from Kissinger, an ardent realist and longtime critic of Ukraine joining the Western alliance is significant. He had told the Council of Foreign Relations in September that such a move would not be wise. The change in attitude is interesting and it remains to be seen if anything has been agreed with Russia, such as the dismemberment of Ukraine over time and military operations and the inclusion of what remains of it in NATO. And this I've translated from a Greek article by S. CR, please leave your comments. Thank you for your support. Kindly support my Patreon account. The daily posts are five videos daily, and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support, and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box.